What is up everybody? This is Rollin' Dirty coming back at you with another video. Today is the 23rd of December. And uh, in Washington State, specifically Western Washington, we've just had a freezing rain storm, which has coated everything with ice, including the roads. At any rate, today I am going to do a different kind of video. Well, same kind of video, different um, piece of equipment. This is my Daihatsu Hijet mini truck. It's four wheel drive with high low and a locking rear diff and dump bed. You'll note that I've lifted it a little bit as well um, with some additional springs and uh, in the bed, I've also added some air struts so that I can take a little bit heavier of a load and keep it balanced. The wheels are beadlock wheels and I've got some actually rather inexpensive ATV tires mounted to those. Uh, fronts are a little narrower than the back. I think the fronts are eight, eight inches wide and the backs are 11 inches wide, if I recall, on the tires. Um, Anyway, th these wheels weren't actually designed for this truck, as you might have guessed. There's, these are ATV wheels, but they work just great, and this thing really gets it. It is the definition of rolling dirty. I've washed it like three times since I bought it, and I use this thing for everything um, that requires four-wheel drive or off-road. My property has a hillside behind it. That's part of our land. It's got a skid road from back when they logged it way back in the day. And uh, I use this thing to go up and down this, that hillside to bring down fallen tree, uh, fallen tree limbs and trunks that I've cut up and we process those for firewood. At any rate, um, this thing gets it. I can get up there, load it up, come back down, dump it, go back and get more, rinse and repeat, and it's been very good to me so far. I added the light bar up top. It's still actually got the plastic on it. You might know that the light's blue and it, it should be clear. Yeah, I should have taken that off. And now the uh, the blue is bonded to the, to the lens, so um, I've actually got another one on order. I'm waiting for it to arrive and we'll replace it. Anyway, I'm just driving down the road here uh, to give you kind of an idea how this thing handles on the ice. This is s straight ice. There's not even anything loose here. This is just solid ice. And I'm in four high. And, uh, you know, it's got four gears, so I can definitely move at whatever speed I feel comfortable moving at. And in this case, I'm doing the speed limit on the size because the four-wheel drive with these tires is uh, is pretty dang good. It does slide a little bit, but it's predictable and recoverable. It's not out of control at all. But today I've got to make a run because they are not um, not they haven't been delivering mail uh, with this with these conditions, and and we've got Christmas presents that our kids are waiting for. So thought I'd make a trip down and see if I could pick up some mail today. Anyway, um, if you have any questions about this this guy, it's it's kind of a fun vehicle. Feel free to ask them in the comments. Um, you know I produce mostly unicycle content, but I figured while I can't be riding the unicycle, this is technically rolling, it's just uh, not a unicycle and it's definitely rolling dirty. So, I thought I might share a little bit, um, a little bit about this truck here, since I haven't actually produced any content, real content around it yet. Let me know. Let me know what you guys think. If you have any questions about it, ask away. I do read the comments. I do answer them. I don't always get to them right away, but I do get to them usually within a few days of uh, of a comment. All right, I'm gonna shut up. Let you watch the footage. I'm just going to roll on this, and then at the end you'll see me uh, 
do a little bit um, in the field on snow. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a very Merry Christmas.